Hey G Squad, welcome back to an episode of Is It Worth It? So this episode we have this cool amazing product right here in my hand and basically what this is is a case for your brand new iPhone 12 Pro. So this one's actually pretty cool because it's not just like a regular case, it's actually a kickstand case so kind of very similar to the one that they released previously. But before I show you guys the previous one, let me actually open up this one to show you guys what it looks like first. So first thing we notice on the actual packaging itself is brand new compared to their previous like style of the cases or like the packaging itself. And if you guys don't know what I mean, I'm talking about like this. Like you guys can see, it's a brand new design that looks way cooler, which is pretty cool. But let's open up first. Alright, so you guys first open up. This is basically what it looks like inside. And then you want to open up the top part right here to take it out. If I didn't see, so here's the case and here's like a warranty card and thank you card right here. Let's take out the case and see what it looks like. So this is basically what the case looks like when seeing. It's definitely a lot bulkier than the older or previous version that they released uh, recently. But as you can see on the side, that's what the button controls look like right there. Same thing for the other side right here. And then the back part, they have the opening for the camera itself. And on the bottom part, they have the opening for the charging slots and also the speakers. And this is what the front part looks like, if you can see. So definitely the design of this case is a lot different than the previous one. Let me show you guys what the previous one that I'm talking about. So if you guys can see, this is the previous one that I'm talking about where they have the kickstand. So you guys need to open up this part manually like this. And you guys can use that kickstand to uh, wash stuff like this, or you can wash stuff like this as well. And for this one, it has a little bit of a raise, and it's not as thick compared to the one that they have for the brand new one right here. If you guys can see a side-by-side -side comparison, it looks about the same there. But for this part right here, it's definitely a lot more thicker. So I'm not sure if that's gonna be an issue for some of you guys. But if it's not an issue for you guys, then definitely this is gonna be a cooler one for you guys. And right off the bat, when you guys look at the design different, it's a lot different. Um, this one is all clear design, whereas this one is like it all covered. So you guys don't really see what the phone is or whatever. You only see like the logo right here. And the way how you guys open up the kickstand for this one is by pushing out right here. And it pops out, which is pretty cool. And when you guys are done using it, push it in like this, close it up. Snap it in, and it's all set. And then probably one of the coolest thing about this brand new case is not only the kickstand right here that's automatic, but right here, they have a very nice grip part right here for you to actually hold it up like that. If you guys want to do videos, photos, or if you guys want to watch videos, it's so much easier than uh, actually using like your hand to hold it up like this because it actually hurts your hand over time when you guys hold it like this or like this. So definitely having this part right here is pretty cool and it definitely has a very nice grip too when you guys actually use it. So let me actually put this on to the actual phone first and show you guys what it actually looks like. All right, so we have the phone right here. You can see it's a blue design, so it goes perfect with the case. You just want to snap it in on all four sides. All right, make sure it's all the way in. And this is basically what it looks like, if you guys can see. The blue actually blends pretty well with the case itself. But if you guys got a different color iPhone, you guys can definitely change to another color as well. Uh, currently, they have it in blue and also black color for this case. And this is basically what the front part looks like. And then, since so this is a kickstand case, you can just poke it out like this. And just start watching stuff like that as well, which is pretty cool. Or you guys can watch it like this angle as well. But I definitely like this brand new feature on this product because of the actual design right here. So if you guys want to take photos or videos, it makes it a lot easier to kind of like have an easy flow to kind of like record stuff or whatever, you guys can see. Compared to when I use like another case like this, it's really uncomfortable when I actually hold like this or like when I record stuff like this. But then obviously there is a downside of using it, like I mentioned, it is a little bit thicker compared to these little cases. These are supposed to be drop protected as well, so if you guys end up dropping it, uh, you guys don't have to worry about it. And the way how you guys look at the actual design of the case, it actually is raised a lot more in this one compared to their previous cases. I think this one was like a 1.5 milliliters, and then for the front side, it's 1.2 uh, milliliters. So the front side is still about the same, but the back side for the actual camera here is raised a little bit more. And then obviously the material that they use on this case versus the older case is a lot better as well. But it's definitely anti-fingerprint, so if you guys do get any fingerprint on here, you guys don't have to worry about it. And it definitely has a very nice grip to it, so you guys don't have to worry about that as well. And also for this case, if you guys want to use it for wireless charging, you can still use it for wireless charging. So let me show you guys a quick test of that really quick. And also show you guys how it looks like on the stand, on the table and everything. And I will come back and talk more about the product in a second. All right, so we got a wireless charger set right here. Let's give it a try. All right, so it does work, if you guys can see. So now let me just try the stand and show you guys what it looks like. So we want to push this part up. And then the stand comes out like that. And now you can use that to stand like this, if you guys can see. Pretty cool. If you guys want to use it the other way, you guys can as well. So like that. So it holds it pretty well. And then once you guys are done, just push the back part in like this. Snap it back in. 
and here's all set. And welcome back guys. So now guys saw the quick test of product itself, you can see it actually does work, actually works quite well. Super easy to use, everything about the product is pretty high quality. So that's basically everything that's on the product itself. Now that we took unboxing and testing of the product itself, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for me, honestly, I would definitely have to say that this case is definitely really worth it if you guys want one and need one of these. Um, for me, I think it's actually much more worth it than this one if you guys don't mind like the um, thickness of the case. <laughs> But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want one or don't need one or have need one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you do need. But other than that, that's pretty much it for quick unboxing and testing on the product itself. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, then make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, then make sure to click on that bell notification in the bottom to be notified of new videos that will be coming up in the future. But as always, make sure to stay positive. Be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.